as airlines uh, carry on requirements for size, and we can just take a ton of stuff with you. So I'm going to show you what you have in there. First off, we've got these rods are for one of my light modifiers. It's a huge um, octobox that I've got for the photography. And I checked in the actual light modifiers, but I couldn't fit this within the suitcase, so I've had to put it strapped onto my camera bag. So hopefully the airline doesn't have an issue with these coming on, but that should be fine. All right, so inside we've got my 60. It's got the 85 mil mounted on it. We've got the A6500 with the 30 mil Sigma 1.4 lens. Uh, I've got the little kit lens that came with the kit lens for the Sony, my vintage Admiral GMC lens, um, 135f2.8. Over here I've got the Sigma 35 1.4, fantastic lens, monitor, audio kit, and underneath that I've got the Edelkrone motion slider plus slider 1, batteries for the monitor, arm for the monitor, then in there I've got my Godox strobe, a bunch of batteries and chargers, a few ND filters and HDMI cables. Here I've got the power pack charger and my remote triggers and that's all I'm going to need in here. It's got the laptop in the front as well. I've got to run because my flight has been announced for recording. So if you're in the market for a good camera bag that you can take on planes without any fears or anything like that of whether you'll be let on the plane with it. Uh, check out Low Pro's 400AW. There's probably a new version I think now called the 450AW. Uh, check that out. It's awesome.